Hey guys, you're watching Keeping It Real with Vasavi, and today's question comes from Barbara, who asks, my past is totally getting in the way of me. Every relationship, every conversation, the way I treat myself is totally driven by my past. Why aren't I moving forward? And can you share how to move past my past? Barbara, that is such a great question. Thank you so much for asking. So number one, like you said, your past is your past, right? It's, it's already gone, it's already done and over with. And the number one thing I would say, just the first thing, when we're talking about expanding your awareness, right? It sounds like you already realize that this is happening, but I want you to start paying attention to it even more. I want you to notice, oh, that's a past conversation. Oh, that's a past belief. That's something that happened in my childhood. This is being fueled by something that someone said. The first step is to just start noticing it. Because once you start noticing it, you'll start seeing it everywhere and then you get to choose. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this thought control me or not. The second thing is you gotta know that you're not your mind. We are not our mind. We are not our body. We are not our thoughts. They're, they're just thoughts. So here's the thing, right? We have so many millions of thoughts a day. Why is it that we choose to stick to some and not to others? Why is it that we pay attention to some thoughts and not another and, and, and not other thoughts, you know? So you have to know that your thoughts are just your thoughts and you are not your mind. In fact, you have more control over your mind than your mind does over you. It really is a choice. So I want you to practice being in the now, thinking in the now, speaking in the now, and doing in the now. Oftentimes people ask, how do I stay in the now? Honestly, this is my experience of being in the now. When I'm in the now, I am totally happy and peaceful, and I am happier than a pig in you know what because I'm not sitting here getting anxious about the future. I'm not sitting and suffering and feeling victimized by the past. I am right here, right now in this moment. And a great book. I have to give a shout out to Eckhart Tolle who wrote The Power of Now. I have it on audiobook. I have the actual book. It literally saved me from my thoughts, from my mind. And I really got to get so clear that I am not my mind. And I want you to realize the same. So first start noticing it. Have other people point it out to you and practice being right here, right now. And notice the difference that it makes. And I promise you, you are gonna get past your past. So if you like this video, share it with your friends. If you want more free weekly Keeping It Real videos, go to my website at vasavikumar.com. And until next time, keep it real.